there is a true way to really have control over your emotion. And it is not something that modern doctor will tell you. It is not something that most people, in fact, will ever tell you. Because everybody is living into a victim way. Because, say, they are like feather in the wind that are pushed toward happiness at times and are pushed towards sadness. But all emotion come from one place only. And it is within your human mechanism. And for this reason, it means that you are the manufacturer of joy, of hate, of love, of sadness, of happiness. It is all created by you. But the thing is, you have given the right to everybody and every event to decide what happened within you. You are happy because somebody makes you happy. You are loving because somebody is loving to you. But this is not how life is supposed to be. You are supposed to be intelligent enough and spiritually evolved enough to rise to a point where you are no more a slave to your mind. And with this understanding that all emotions come from within, it means that you can create them on command. And this is how you truly have control over your emotion. This is how you cease to be so deeply affected by your emotion that depending on how you feel, you might be procrastinating, you might be taking action, you might be just falling down or rising to a higher possibility. So if you think about it, how can I feel happiness or love? Let's focus on love, in fact. Just close your eyes and think about something that makes you feel love within yourself. Maybe a memory, maybe someone, something. And once you really feel it, let go of the image, of the memory, but sustain the energy. You will begin to notice that there is a certain frequencies, like a radio station. You can tune yourself into love, into hate, into happiness, any emotion that you wish. And once you have tuned yourself here, unlike a radio where it just stays here, it is like if the button want to turn back into the neutral position. But you, with your willpower, with your energy, you have to keep it where you want it to be. Whether it is love, joy, happiness, whatever it is. And once you understand this, and you begin to really practice this every single day, whether you're at work, you're driving your car, you're at home alone, you're watching TV, you practice to feel love at all times. Not for somebody, not for something, just to be love. Because when we say love is unconditional, most people will still think about love between two persons. But love between two persons is a condition. Unconditional love is when you become love yourself. And if you truly practice this and you master it, then all other negative emotions will just slowly die. Because how could you be sad if you feel love? How could you feel hate if you feel love? How could you be obsessed by someone's opinion or words if again you feel love within yourself? So become a master of your emotion. Become a powerful alchemist. And whatever life gives you, you will be the one who convert it into the emotion of your desire. And because you will be controlling what you feel at all moments, this will allow you to manifest something that will be in harmony with the energy that you are sustaining. So which emotion do you feel to start with? Let me know within the comment and I will share with you an affirmation in a way to feel it and to sustain it. And if you found any value, I welcome you to like and subscribe because every Friday or more videos are coming your way for your spiritual growth because it truly matters to me. I'm Simon and together we grow spiritually.